Batman has a strict moral code that forbids him to just kill criminals. So either you kill Bane! <laughs> no, I won't kill him. Because if Batman were to kill people, he'd be no better than those he's bringing to justice, right? Any one of my guys would have killed him. The city deserves better than that. Batman is, though, totally fine with crippling them for life and leaving them unconscious in the street miles from the nearest emergency room. What? He's technically still alive, if you can call it living. Haha, <laughs> loophole! 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 Actually, this new Arkham Knight gameplay trailer reminds us that the way Batman applies his moral code is more relaxed than ever. There's no way the following guy survived these bat attacks. The Arkham Knight trailers show Batman smashing this man's head into an electrical junction box. You don't have to be the world's greatest detective to deduce what happens to someone if you plug their head into the main's electricity supply. In Batman's defense, the actual murderer in this case is electricity? Loophole! The Arkham Knight trailer for the new Batmobile makes a big deal of explaining that Batmobile's 60mm cannon, Vulcan gun and missile barrage are just for use against unmanned tank drones. Unmanned, alright? What, am I not allowed to murder drones now? For human targets, the Batmobile is equipped with, quote, non-lethal slam rounds that do, quote, minimum long-term trauma. Tell that to this guy who gets uppercutted by Batman and then shot in the head at point-blank range with one of these non-lethal rounds. You'll probably need a medium on account of how dead he will be. Thanks to the level design in Batman Arkham Origins, it is possible for Batman to straight up murder cops in open world gameplay by backclawing them off high ledges so they fall hundreds of feet to the floor below. <laughs> although, although, it's actually gravity that killed them in this scenario, eh? Loophole? Well, it does explain the Gotham PD's position on vigilante lawbringer Batman. My side doesn't leave suspects with broken bones and missing teeth. Now I'm no doctor, but I imagine a propane tank detonating in your face would be enough to shuffle you off this mortal coil. Diagnosis? Ultra dead. Do you think he's just set that cow to pretend everyone is unconscious, to keep up appearances? Ooh, chilling. Now I'm convinced Batman means to kill this guy. He's already on the floor when Batman tonks him in the throat with a car door. What kind of a monster are you, Bruce? And stay down! I mean, you will, obviously. So that was the ostensibly anti-murder Batman doing a bunch of murders. Have you done anything in the Arkham series that, on reflection, was maybe a tiny bit of a murder? Let us know in the comments and keep it locked to Outside Xbox for lots more Arkham Knight coverage coming soon. Nice rescue, Batman, you maniac. Thanks for watching!